trying to play one forwards. Jordao couldn't quite intercept it. Ball stood up to try and run in behind. Vallejo has let it bounce, and there's an early opportunity for Reading as they're back onto their right foot and striking in. John Ruddy saves well at his near post to deny Lucas Boy. And Wolves just went to sleep a little bit at the back, and it was an early opportunity that Ruddy did well to turn round for a corner. It's Ryan Bennett. Looking to knock a long one in the path of Catrone. It's gone over the top, and Catrone into the penalty on his left foot. Low across, good save by the goalkeeper. That's a good effort from Catrone, spinning his man, getting in behind, but he couldn't quite punish Reading. Here's Neto. Doherty trying to drive on. Excellent ball to find Gibbs White into the penalty area, onto his right foot, shooting, not enough power behind it, straight at the goalkeeper. Vinagre will take. Catrone had come short. Gibbs White's there as well. Vinagre still waiting for somebody to throw it to. In the end goes down the line to Catrone, who turns away from Charlie Adam like he wasn't there. Finds Jordao, who lines one up from distance, or the goalkeeper spells it. And Bruno Jordao scores on his first team debut. A massive stroke of fortune, but he will not care. It's Wolves 1, Reading now. Vinagra up towards the edge of the penalty a great run trying to hit the curling effort on his weaker foot couldn't get it on target he's playing that role as he delivers across high to the far post though as he had to deal with it comes to Barrett puts it back into the danger zone to the far post headed down and away by Ryan Bennett from just in front of the goal line and all surviving for the time being inside the Reading half and it's Swift Right-hand corner of the penalty area, back onto his left foot, now on his right, trying to slide it in for Puskas. Puskas oh, firing, and John Ruddy has done brilliantly at the near post to tip that round the corner and behind. He came to Wolves' rescue early in the game, and he's done similarly right at the death here. Potter. Now trying to launch it into the penalty area, Neves cleared it, went through the legs of Kundal to Ajaria, who tries to shoot from distance, and that one was troubling John Ruddy. And I think he got something on that, you know. Yeah. It's been given as a corner. It may well go down as another excellent, excellent save from John Ruddy. Here comes John Swift over the halfway line for Reading through the middle of the half. Finding Ajaria to his left. Further on to Barrett. Up against Perry. Now trying to lift it right-footed out to the right-hand side. Just outside the area for Rinham Hotter. On to Swift, who'd made a run. Little Rabona cross. Headed in. Oh, and an equaliser. Right at the death from Boy. And Reading get themselves back on level terms. Can he win us the penalty shootout? I wonder. George Pushkas, right footed against John Ruddy for the first of the penalty kicks in the shootout. Ruddy on his line. Pushkas steps up and oh. strikes it high to Ruddy's right hand side and passed him into the back of the net. Neves has scored four and missed one in his career. Here he comes, Ruben Neves sends the keeper the wrong way. Lovely penalty, goalkeeper gets left. Neves' his penalty went to his right. It's 1-1 one, one after one each of the shootout. Yeah, never in doubt, was it? Ruddy reaching high to touch the crossbar. To try and put Swift off who will step up right-footed in front of the North Bank, and Ruddy saves! Diving low to his left-hand side. Big John Ruddy comes up trumps again. To go ahead in the shootout. Jesus Vallejo sends the keeper the wrong way. Wolves are in front. This time Virginia dived to his right-hand side, and Vallejo just opened out his body and stroked it the other way. Here comes Boy, whistles around Molyneux, right footed, oh, he passed over! Right over the top, nowhere near. Can he score again tonight? Ryan Bennett striding forwards, blasting it low into the bottom left-hand corner. That is a lovely penalty from Ryan Bennett, and it gives Wolves a 3-1 lead after three. Miaska stepping up and scoring. Sending John Ruddy the wrong way. Ruddy gets to his right. The ball went to his left. Wolves three, Reading two. 
and here comes Ruben Vinagre. Ruben Vinagre, left-footed, to send Wolves through. A couple of short steps. Vinagre now sets it the wrong way, and Wolves win the penalty shootout. Two penalty defeats in the last two years. No more. Wolves go through to round four. Oh, good composure from him as well. Four great penalties from Wolves. And again, they put the Celsius into the next round.